Sweeney Todd is a lot like that ritualistic story that everyone has a version of what it is. And our job is to make it fresh for an audience each night um, to uh, kind of retell it with this particular ensemble. It's a story about people, I think, obsessively sometimes going overboard with what they need and what they think they want. And then consequently, they reel right out of control. It's quite a complex role because it's, it's not in the sort of normal tradition of musical theater. It's not sort of by the numbers. It's a very, it, it has all the depth of a, of a drama. Well, I did lots of research into what it was like to be a woman then and the laws that restricted your right to property, essentially the right for a man having ownership over your body. It's a surprising piece of theatre that um, there's no uh, frilly stuff to it. It really gets to the heart of human nature and, and what a human could, could do if pushed to this. Um, there's tons of laughs in it. Uh, there's tons of uh, drama in it as well. Sondheim has so clearly um, chiseled out every character's um, path, uh, not just with the dialogue and the book with Hugh Wheeler, but specifically the music is full of the dynamics of these follies and the dynamics of these desires and the dynamics of these, you know, failures. It's a very sort of intense period of rehearsal to get the thing as true and real as you can possibly get it. We get together for small periods of time and then we, we we fix little things together and then we, we go off and we all go and talk about how excited we are about it. And then we get back together and we, we, we add a couple more details and it, it keeps building and building. And so, yeah, everybody's throwing in all their best stuff and it's, it's very exciting to be a part of. And I get to work with my wife, which is very exciting and it's the first time we've ever worked together. We got to do Our Town together and then Sweeney. But it's nice to know that my scene partner is supportive 100% and we'd do anything for each other. So I think that helps in the play that we feel so comfortable to, to try anything. And, and that's been really fun. The company itself is a very, very strong group of people. And that's sort of been led by the whole ethos of what the Shaw Festival is. Every single person in the company knows they have a responsibility to the play first and foremost. Everyone's learning something so major, whether they get it or whether they decide to take it and run with it or drop the ball and deny it, whatever. These, all, the story is right at that point where everyone is about to move forward. It appeals to a lot of different people. People that don't think that they'd like a musical, I think they'd really like this musical because, because of all the different elements of, of the, the darkness and the comedy and, and just the, the pathos that this gives. An audience will come together, whether they've never seen it or whether they've seen it a hundred times. The story is so extraordinary, uh, compiled with the music in this company. I think people will walk away um, completely uh, wanting to see it again.